it's, I don't think it's worth your life. You saw him, right? He's enormous. Just so they know we're not fibbing. <laughs> it's okay, Bob. <clears throat> it's okay, hey. You're okay, guy. It's okay. She was talking to me through the camera. Oh, okay. I was like, oh, hey. Hi. Hey. Here we go. I can't hit the button. More landlord friendly and deal with an even more favorable landscape, right? And again, that's why I've moved a lot of business over to places like Lorraine, right? Again, I mentioned it earlier. O'Leary is another good one. Canton, Akron. But like this one right here, we're well above the 1% roll. It's just kind of a set and forget it. You know, simple. Tenants rocking and rolling. They're doing their thing. When their lease expires, give them a 30 day notice, bump that rent up, keep it chugging. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show, folks. Thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. In the Cleveland market, y'all, it's not just Cleveland. As a matter of fact, in my opinion, Cleveland is not even the most attractive city for landlords in the Cleveland market anymore, okay? I've been moving a lot of my business, a lot of my money, moving a lot of things over west into Lorain County, like a half hour away from Cleveland. You got Elyria and the city of Lorain itself, and today's deal is in Lorain. 120 West 25th Street, okay? This is a single family coming to you guys at 79.9, one percent rule. What would that dictate? That would dictate a market rent of 7.99. Nah, nah, we're doing way better than that, man. We are getting 1,175, and if after this tenant's lease expires in like four or five months, uh, they still are staying. Of course, we're gonna definitely increase it up, go up to 1,200. Okay, I'm feeling. Lorraine these days, y'all. I think the numbers in Lorraine better than in Cleveland. The landlord-tenant laws in Lorraine, more landlord-friendly than in Cleveland, right? In Lorraine, you don't have to deal uh, with the new biannual lead certification program that Cleveland put out, right? They're, they're really starting to do a lot of legislation and a lot of BS in Cleveland, um, to, to really go after landlords, especially out-of-state landlords, right? And you're not seeing that in a lot of the surrounding cities, right? So places like Elyria, Lorraine, uh, you go the other direction, you go south, you go Canton, Akron. A lot of that stuff is a much better atmosphere right now uh, than the actual city itself of Cleveland, right? So it's kind of goofy, right? You're in the Cleveland market. You probably found this video because you're Googling investing in the Cleveland market, but now you're finding out that Cleveland's actually the most difficult city in the entire Cleveland market for investors, right? But that's what we do here at Holton Wise, folks. That's what Holton Wise TV is all about. It's about providing you guys, the viewer, the investor, right? It's about providing you that education, right? That on the ground insight, right? When everybody else is zigging, you got to zag, man. We're trying to keep you ahead of the curve, trying to make sure you are armed with the knowledge and experience and education uh, to be the most profitable investors you possibly can be, right? And we could, of course, manage this asset for you. We could handle everything on your behalf, the property management, the maintenance, construction, uh, even the insurance. We could do it all for you, right? Put it all together in a nice little turnkey bow. But before any of that, folks, it's about me being up here on this show presenting you guys with an on-the-ground look at what is going on in these cash flow markets, right? Because I know most of you that are watching, you guys are coming from other spots, right? You guys are coming from California. You're coming from Portland. You're coming from New York. Now, just so you all know, I'm telling you that Cleveland is starting to make some legislation and do some things that are not really very landlord friendly uh if you're basing that or comparing that to life for landlords in new york portland all of california or new jersey even right if you're in one of those locations it's still gonna feel pretty landlord friendly okay ohio is a red state but cleveland is a blue city uh so they, they are doing some pretty obnoxious stuff, but we're, we're still overall protected by the state of Ohio being a red state. So it's not going to be as batshit, lunatic-ass crazy as what y'all are used to. But even though the stuff in Cleveland is more 
landlord friendly than what y'all are used to if you're in those crazy democratic strongholds right those like woke areas uh even though it's it's like a lot more landlord friendly than that you know you don't have to settle for that you could get even more landlord friendly and deal with an even more favorable landscape right and again that's why i've moved a lot of business over to places like lorraine right again i mentioned it earlier Elyria is another good one canton akron but like this one right here we're well above the one percent roll it's just kind of a set and forget it you know simple tenants rocking and rolling they're doing their thing when their lease expires give them a 30 day notice bump that rent up keep it chugging right nothing major crazy sexy about this deal right it's just a a nice solid you know deal a little notch in the bedpost so to speak right so if you're interested in buying this thing send your offers to my team at sales at holtonwise.com if you're paying cash great include your proof of funds if you're financing it that's totally fine too why put down all the money when the bank will put down 75 percent just Give me your pre-approval letter with your offer. Be like, yo, man, I want to buy one 20 West 25th. I want to offer 80K. Here is my pre-approval letter. If you do not have a lender, you can fuck right off and go home. I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm here for you. You don't have to fuck off. No, no, no. This is the anti-fuck off show. I'm here to help you, right? Just, just come just come give me a hug, man. Let me help you out. I have lenders for you guys, okay? If you're in any of the aforementioned horrible uh, left-wing states, right, trying to escape the socialism, right? If you're in Cali, you're in Jersey, you're in New York, you're in that dirty, dirty shithole Portland, Oregon, right? If you're in any of those joints, I got lenders for you. Don't think that you have to be local to the Cleveland market to utilize my lenders. No, 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 no. I've been doing this a very long time, y'all. Clients from all over, a lot of those states. We even got clients in Canada, the UK, Singapore, right? So we have actual uh, investor lenders that are writing loans to guys and gals in all 50 states, uh, in several other countries, right? So if you guys need lenders for these deals, we got them, right? Traditional lenders, hard money lenders, commercial lenders, private money lenders, uh, you know, we got it all, right? Even if you're not trying to buy this particular property and, and you need lenders, man, just let us know. We'll hook you up, right? Uh, over the last decade or so, 10, 15 years of doing $200 million to sale in Ohio, we've built up like this just massive network, uh, you know, of investors and lenders and whatnot. And uh, yeah, you guys could have that, right? You could have my entire Rolodex, right? All digestible, nice little easy digestible list. Uh, let me know. You could have it, man. Maybe you're trying to flip houses in Baltimore or you're trying to, I don't know, do buy and hold investments in Texas or Arizona, whatever, man, whatever you're trying to do. Uh, I do have lenders that are looking for more clients and you're looking for more money. So I'll go ahead and connect you guys. So just let me know, sales at holtonwise.com. And if you're one of the people that want to buy my property here, but don't have a lender, you could go ahead and get pre-approved through one of those lenders. They'll hook you up with the pre-approval. Once you have that, you go ahead and send that offer in to me and we'll be off to the races. So I don't think it's worth your life. You saw him, right? He's enormous. He's coming. Hey, are you okay? Should I stop and talk to him? It's okay. I know. Just so they know we're not fibbing. <laughs> it's okay, Pop. <clears throat> it's okay. Hey. I feel like he's not going to attack, though. He's but if he does, we're dead. He's enormous. He's a puppy, though. Come on. Just step back. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. You're okay, guy. It's okay. All right. Give me two minutes and we'll be in and out, guys. Thank you.
Hey, I'm sorry. We'll be done in just a second. I'm just doing a quick little video walkthrough. No, it's good. And that's it. We uh we already did the basement actually. We just so we don't get mud everywhere or dirt or anything. He's done. Yeah, we're good. We just missed them. They would have been able I kind of, yeah, she, she was talking to me through the camera. Oh, okay. I was like, oh, hey. Hi. Hey. Here you go. I can't hit the button. Just yeah, yeah, I got you. Pop it, it's right here. Yep. Cool. This is a basement. Where is the bed back there? I don't know if I can reach it, but... That's the good thing about it. The gimbal being so light. A lot of light down here. Pretty new furnace. Or a hot water tank. Furnace is a little warmer. Yeah, John was texting about the fridge, too. Watch your step. There's some poopies down here. A couple of them. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.